You have to believe in yourself. You have to believe that it's possible because you can create your reality. The perception that you have of the world, if you think there's only scarcity, there's no opportunity, that's how you are going to interact with reality. If you think that there's abundance, if you think that there's opportunity, then these things will manifest themselves to you. So you have to believe that you can, mm. right? And the way that you believe and the way that you can get to that state, because a lot of people are like, you know, I have, I have a lot of doubt. So do I. I have it all the time. Even if at these levels, right? You're doing seven figure months. Dude, there's people doing eight figure months. That's hard. To, that's hard to fathom. That's hard to imagine. Yeah. But it's still possible. Yeah, of course. Is it yeah. difficult? Absolutely. But it's a mindset shift. So it's a mindset shift. One of, hey, it's possible. Two, it's an abundance mindset. You can either have a delusion of scarcity, which most people are like, hey, you know, it's not possible or this is not a reality. And I get it. it this, sir, our lives are so far. Fa- we're dude, we're sitting in a, in a suite in Dubai right now. Yeah. How old are you? 26. Okay. I'm 26 for 28. This isn't normal. This mm. isn't normal. Mm. So like, I, I get it. Like I get it. The people that are listening and watching and they're like, bro, is this actually real? It's funny though, because to us it's normal. Because we've lived this for a while. Because it's become the reality yeah. that we've created. Yeah. Because it's the mindset that we've been able to determine, achieve, and establish. Yeah. However, for the average person, they may not see it. And I, and I get it because you have to have a delusional mindset. Yeah. You have to be so far out there to believe that it's possible. Because I, I assume you come from the trenches just like me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's yeah. like, it's we the same perspective. The it's the same perspective. It's like you, you grow up, people are broke. I, I look at all my high school buddies. They're working very low paying jobs. Some of them committed suicide. Some of them are divorced. Like I get it. Like life isn't easy, but you can create the delusion of scarcity or the delusion of abundance. Mm. And I just decided to create the delusion of abundance that it was possible that I could make more money, that I could build better networks, that I could actually provide value to people. And as time went on and I gained more experience and as I became more developed, these opportunities began to show themselves to me. And what I tell people is that money is a lagging indicator of success. Money doesn't come right away. You have to be able to put in the hours and the work and have the mindset of a CEO and have the mindset of a boss to do so. To, to be able to say no to the paycheck because the paycheck is the instant gratification of your labor. Mm-hmm. The CEO is the last one to get paid. Yeah. The CEO is the one that takes the risks, but no risk, no Ferrari. And we know this to be true. If you want to win the game of life, if you want to take it to the top, you have to be able to sacrifice who you are today for who you want to become. And for a lot of people, they may just be comfortable with their nine to five and I completely get it and I validate it. If that's what you want to live and if you're happy, so be it. But I'm willing to neglect the money in the short term and not get that paycheck just because I understand that if you plant enough seeds in due time, you will reap massive rewards. And it worked out.